If you're not using ChatGPT to get more subscribers on YouTube right now, in specific to get 100,000 subscribers in the next 30 days, then you are missing the biggest opportunity of 2023. Because if you struggle to come up with topic ideas, title ideas, or even scripts for your video or have no idea what to say once you turn the camera on, ChatGPT can solve all of that. And in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. In fact, these same tips that I share with you help this creator gain 100,000 subscribers in just 30 days, and this creator 100,000 subscribers in 30 days. And you can be the next person if you simply follow the five steps that program that I'm about to lay out for you in this video. But before we can dive into it, I need you to smash that subscribe button. If you want to grow quicker on YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok, I literally upload a video about how to grow on these platforms every single day. In addition to that, I created a free YouTube growth course. You can get it the link in the pinned comment below. It's going to share with you the best time to post on YouTube right now and what tags to use in your posts in order to go viral. On top of that, here's my phone number. Please hit me up. I want to help you grow quicker on YouTube. Step number one is going to be using ChatGPT in order to get new topics. For example, you want to ask ChatGPT what kind of content you should be creating within your niche. You want to ask it what the most searched terms are in your niche. You want to ask it what the most popular terms are in your niche. And you also want to ask it the most popular videos, but you can't stop there. Once you get this information, you need to take it a step further. You need to go to step two and actually go to YouTube and type into YouTube the idea that ChatGPT gave you. And then you need to put hashtag shorts, type it in. Now you're going to see a few things come up here. Oh, by the way, you also want to filter for the last 30 days because it isn't going to be relevant if it's not within the last 30 days because essentially that's how YouTube works. If you don't know how YouTube works, YouTube is going to suggest content to people based on the past content that they've watched, aka they're going to be looking at people that have watched content in the last 30 days, in the last 14 days, even the last time that they logged on to YouTube to determine what kind of content they should be pushing. Now, it's exactly where this is going to come into because you're going to do those searches and you're going to rule out some of those topics that ChatGPT gave you. In fact, this is where a lot of creators go wrong. They go based off of exactly what ChatGPT gave them and do no further investigation. You need to understand something. Now that everybody can use ChatGPT, everybody can use AI, it's not just those ideas that are generated that is going to cause success. It's whether or not you actually vet those ideas and it's how well you can prompt ChatGPT to give you better ideas. For example, when it gives you topics, you can say, make it better, make it more curiosity, make it more fear-based, make it whatever the case is, but you need to make sure that you're using different prompts to get better ideas, taking those ideas, plugging them into YouTube search, putting hashtag shorts at the end, filtering for 30 days, and then you're going to want to rule out a lot of those ideas. The way that you're going to do this, anything with under 10,000 views, get rid of it. Anything with 10,000 to 100,000 views, that's a good idea. Anything with 100,000 to a million views, that's a great idea. Anything with over a million views in the last 30 days that ChatGPT gave you is an absolutely amazing idea, and you need to make sure that you're moving forward with those and the other ones. But I would be moving forward with those first. In addition to that, you can't stop there. Okay, so now that you found out what topics are actually good, we need to get into the real secret sauce, which you're going to be able to use ChatGPT for, and that is that you now need to get the links for all of those videos. You need to know the title for the video, you need to know the link, and you need to know how long that video was and also how many views it got, because you're gonna need to use this information later on. But what you're gonna need to do right now is go to youtubetranscript.com and type in those URLs. It's going to spit out for you the script for those videos, and then what you're gonna do, you're gonna bring that script over to ChatGPT, and you're gonna tell it to make this script better. You can have it make the hook better. You can have it make the ending better. You can have it make the call to action better. You need to have it make all of these things better. And on top of that, you need to be paying attention to this because so many people will just take what ChatGPT spits out and go and create a video about that. But there needs to be a human component. You guys need to understand something. AI is great. But you know what's even better? AI plus a human that actually knows what works on YouTube. I'll give you a prime example. If you just take the transcript from ChatGPT and it doesn't have a hook and it doesn't have a call to action, you're not gonna get 100,000 subscribers in the next 30 days. Why? Because you need a call to action in your content. If we go back to the beginning of this video, I put a call to action in this video and that is why I'm gonna get 1,000 subscribers on YouTube today. And that is why I'm going to pass a million subscribers on YouTube this year because I continue to do that in my content and you need to make sure that you're doing it also, but you probably need to come up with that call to action because ChatGPT doesn't really know what the best call to action is because it doesn't actually understand what that is in the context of YouTube yet. ChatGPT is great for writing scripts, but you need to make sure that you're editing those scripts. You also need to make sure that you're making those titles that you saw better. Again, you have that information. So now we know exactly what topic you're going after. We know what script you're going to use. We know what things you're going to look out for in that script, making sure there's a good hook, making sure there's rehooks. You need to make sure that the editing matches up to what the other video was. Make sure that the words per second also match up to what that other video was. And then you need to improve on the title. Now there are two ways for you to do this. One, 
You could do this manually, which I strongly suggest that you do because there are certain things that a YouTube title needs or certain things you could do to a YouTube title and actually make it better. But before I share those with you, I do want to warn you. I see so many creators just copying other people's titles. You cannot do that because you need to understand if you copy somebody else's title word for word and create the same exact video and your video does not do better than theirs, that's why YouTube's not pushing out your content because YouTube's going to see the two videos that have the same title. Theirs got more watch time than yours. Theirs attracted more viewers than yours. Theirs attracted more returning viewers. And on top of that, they probably clicked onto another one of that creator's videos before or after, and that's why their video gets pushed out more than yours. I get this question so often. So you need to actually make the title better. You need to make sure that the script is better, and you need to make sure that you're either doing this manually or with ChatGPT. Now, I wouldn't really trust ChatGPT to do this. It would be a lot better if you actually understood what makes a good title. For example, putting an authority in a title. Another example, adding random caps into titles, and also making sure that you're adding power words into your title. If you're not doing Doing things like this, it's going to be the reason that your videos don't work even though you use ChatGPT or you might be messing up this last thing which is that once something works, you need to make sure that you're doubling down on it. I see so many creators mess this up, especially small channels on YouTube. I see them and I look at so many of your guys' accounts. You guys had a video that got 10,000 views, 100,000 views, a lot of you even a million views. And then what you do, the next video you create is on a different topic. It's a totally different format. It's a totally different length. You need to understand YouTube is looking at all these things. You might've made a video about a topic that might not be something that you wanted to go viral for, but you went viral for it. What would I suggest that you do is go down the rabbit hole. Keep making content about that. Why? Because the bigger you get, the easier it is to switch into different niches. A lot of you want to spread out into all these niches in the beginning, and that's why you fail to grow on YouTube. Or you don't do the other right things, like editing your videos correctly, making sure the pacing's good. Because somewhere where ChatGPT fails is it can't actually watch your videos and tell you what to improve on. But I can do that, and I can guarantee that you get more subscribers in my YouTube mentorship if you go to the link in the description below and get signed up right now. In the next 30 days, I will get you more subscribers on YouTube guaranteed. In fact, if I don't get you more subscribers, you're going to get your money back. Zero questions asked. Then here's how it's going to work. I'm going to tell you exactly what to post. We're going to look at your analytics. We're going to analyze them together. Another thing ChatGPT can't do. This is the same program that all the creators that I share with you early in the video went through to gain 100,000 subscribers in just 30 days. And I'm confident that I can help you get more subscribers too. In fact, I'm going to guarantee it. But there are limited spots. You need to go to the link in the description right now if you're interested in that. Sign up and in the next 30 days, you're going to get guaranteed growth on YouTube or you're going to get your money back. Zero questions asked. Again, if that sounds interesting, go to the link in the description below. Get into it right now because there are limited spots available. If not, I strongly suggest you check out the next two videos I put up on the screen because they're the videos that YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thank you so much for watching.